Super Doppler 7 weather. Good morning to you. A live look right now off the Sandia Crest. A little bit of haze this morning. Lots of humidity too, about 40% or so. But that will be improving throughout the day. It is 453 right now, sitting at 75 degrees. Just an indication of how warm we're going to be once again. High pressure sticking around across New Mexico for at least today, which means hot, dry conditions once again. Any rain we'll see, and we'll get to this here in just a second. We'll stay north and west. At this point, it's not looking like a whole lot, though. We'll have a backdoor cold front pushing tomorrow. That does mean increasing chances of moisture across our state every day into the weekend, especially even here in the metro area. Here's future track what you can expect in the way of that rain again about midday or so going into the afternoon. That's when in those upper elevations we could start to see some showers and storms mostly on the southern Colorado northern New Mexico border, but into the evening hours. That's when that rain kind of wraps around. We see it hit the four corners area. It does look to see a little more cloud coverage than rain at this point, but into tomorrow are looking like we could see better chances of those showers and storms. Let's talk numbers, shall we? Temperatures right now, like I said, 60s and 70s, not too bad out there for your morning drive into today, getting to about average temperatures, actually. Northern New Mexico looking for 91 in Taos, 90 in Los Alamos, 90 in Santa Fe. Just a heads up again, some of you could see some of that smoke from the doghead fire because we're going to have south southwest winds today. 97 in TRC, 96 in Alamogordo, and pushing into the metro area, calling for 98 degrees in Albuquerque. Here's your seven day forecast as we go through the week. Those temperatures not letting go. We're going to see 100 into tomorrow, hot temperatures over the weekend, and more showers and storms Saturday and Sunday.